bedroom lights. Echo, turn on bedroom lights. Okay. Good morning. I can't see right now, my eyes are too blurry. So I'm going to do this little intro on my shot. Yeah. Probably shouldn't do one pass. So sleepy. Anyway. Um. Yeah, I'm going to get out of bed for this intro because my, this just ain't doing it for me and I'm going to fall back to sleep. Be right back. slept for about an extra hour because I just didn't have enough energy in me. I only had four hours of sleep. Um, so now I'm going to go... I can't imagine someone stay straight on the trap these days. It's really annoying me. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and have a shower. Also, I don't know if it's noticeable, but I had my mum cut my hair. I've just been doing start Covid when I had hair this long and she cut it to, I think it was her, yeah, and she's just done a really uneven job, but like at the same time I'm not too bothered because I usually wear my hair curly, so yeah, anyway, my hair's gone lopsided again, it doesn't matter, I'm going to go jump into the shower now and just hopefully that'll wake me up properly because right now I'm good for absolutely nothing. Um, yeah, I've just had my shower, it's practically 9am, yeah 9 or 1am right now, had my shower, dry my hair, styled my hair into these lovely waves, curls, whatever you want to call them, and I'm not exactly sure but I think I might fall asleep on my bed after I styled it because I was like I'm just going to rest my head a bit because I felt really tired, um, yeah, but it's alright, there's no rush to go about my day because I really just have to finish unpacking, which might seem a bit weird if you've watched my previous video, which hopefully will be me, the me moving in vlog. Either way, I need to finish unpacking and start editing that vlog. My video's going tilted, something just doesn't seem right with my camera these days, like this tripod. Maybe this is what I get for buying a cheap tripod from Amazon, but hey up. Um, yeah, so right now I'm just going to go downstairs, have a coffee, have something for breakfast, no idea what, and yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. I feel like still out of it. I feel like for most of this video I'm going to be very much in a weird mood because I'm like struggling to think properly. I also need to drink plenty of water because when I last went to the opticians the woman could tell that I hadn't drank enough and I was like well yes the only liquid I've consumed today has been one cup of coffee and she's like yeah I can see that just by looking in my eyes so I asked how much I should drink and yeah she said it's something like two to three litres so that's what I'm going to go ahead and try and get done also, so that's where we're at right now, and um, yeah, got nothing else to add. So I'll see you. Just got like less than a minute to do. Um, I 
don't think there's any more I can do on this video right now without it getting time consuming. So I'm going to bring this laptop upstairs and I've saved the project now. Good old control S. And yeah, I'm going to organise myself to leave because I am due to leave in about 15 minutes. So that is where we're at right now. I've drank about two litres of water. The last 500 mils have gone down horribly. Um, I think it's because I've just been forcing myself the last, what, two, three hours to just drink loads of water. And I don't usually drink that much water. And so I felt like I was going to vomit it as soon as I was holding it. So, <laughs> lovely. But anyway, we're going to bring this upstairs and we are going to get ready to leave. Let's go. I don't care about this but I have one contact lens for astigmatism and one that's just normal um, and yeah so this is my first day of wearing them I have to keep them in until 8pm according to I want to call the lady a doctor but I don't know if that's the correct term so I'm going to call her the eye person um, yeah she told me to keep them in until 8pm so I'll do that and I have to wear I have to build up my tolerance um, a bit yeah, so first day four hours, the next time I wear them six hours, time after that eight hours, time after that ten hours, and time after that twelve, and then time after that fourteen, because these contact lenses I have, I can have them for a maximum of fourteen hours. Um, so yeah, that is that. I have them in. This one is a bit uncomfortable, but that's my eye that has astigmatism. But yeah, so this has been my eventful day. I guess if I had to take anything from it, I'd say that unless you have to go out and be somewhere for like 6 or 7, a 5am morning routine wouldn't be sustainable, at least not for me. What I found was right away from the get-go, I was so, so, so tired getting up at that time. Um, and because of that, it took me longer to complete tasks, which would have been much quicker to accomplish. It made me procrastinate a lot more. Like, admittedly, I can procrastinate quite a lot without any excuses, like not sleeping well. But I found that waking up early like that just didn't work well for me, as it made me even more tired. And yeah, so it can be a good idea if you want to get a lot of stuff done in the morning. Um, but now it's like, well, it's five o'clock now, and I'm ready to just crash. I'm ready to go to sleep, go to bed. But I've got to keep these in side p.m. Um, and yeah. So that has been it. If you want me to try doing a 5 a.m. morning routine once I'm back at uni, once uni is back in session, um, I can try that. But I guess let me know down below if that's something you'd actually be interested in seeing. If in like a full uni day, waking up at 5 a.m. will actually do anybody any good whatsoever. Maybe you tell me. Um, yeah. That is about it, and I guess I will see you next week for another video. Bye!